The CP Republic is brought to you by Smart and Talk and Text. And uh, we are now at the hands-on review segment of the CP Republic. We are here with, uh, with Jam, my co-host. Uh, as promised earlier, ano, pag-uusapan natin today ang hand, uh, hands-on review ng ano, Huawei GR5. One of our uh, parang anticipated talaga na smartphones, kasi matagal na natin ito pinag-uusapan, diba? Sabi ka, wow, GR5 is a uh, pretty good smartphone for its price. Na, yeah. Ano, and maganda yung specs niya. Yeah, so maganda nga ba talaga? Oh, well, yun ang malalaman natin today. Yeah, malalaman natin today. So... Um, actually, before we start, um, I'm going to, you know, I'm going to remove this. Um, uh, well, it's not really a crystal case. Para siyang frost, ano eh, frost case in uh, transparent, which is an, ano, uh, maganda yung pagka ano niya, maganda yung pagkagawa niya sa case, fit na fit. At saka, uh, ano, you can s- still see the original color, no. And it comes with the package. It comes with the package ng, ano, ng Huawei GR5, so which adds more va, ano, uh, adds to the value, already good value of the GR5. Na marami na kita ng phone na to with this with this case on and sa nagbili ng case, no, it's already part of the GR5, so uh, they're impressed. But if you remove the uh, the case, voila, it's all metal. Yeah. Alam mo, yung parang yun parang nagiging generic na yung ganyan design. <laughs> ng back yan. Kasi parang ang dami ng ganyan na. Brushed ano, metal. Brushed metal. Taas ng baba ay sa ganun, may line. Yeah, and yung gold. Yung gaya itong gold na rin. So, getting a, ano, getting a parang generic or something. Yeah, but uh, okay pa rin. I mean... Yeah, it doesn't disappoint. Yeah. Hindi pa rin siya, ano, hindi pa rin siya, hindi pa, di, di pa naman nakakasuka na, ano, <laughs> suka na, talaga yung word. Oo, oh, na... Ano ba yan? Uh, lahat na lang nakikita ko gold. Lahat na nakikita ko metal. Pero, yeah. this uh, design of Huawei naman is, ano eh, uh, somehow, may counting differentiating factor. Actually, this one looks like a mini, ano eh, uh, uh, a sister of the, ano, Mate 8. Uh-huh. Pero, this one is smaller, of course, than the Mate 8. And, uh, of course, yung, ano, specs nito is, ano, are, are lower than the Mate 8. However, these, specs of the GR5 are respectable enough uh, to be, you know, uh, to be considered as one of the uh, very good contenders for, you know, for the mid-range market. So, uh, power buttons here, volume controls are on the right. Uh, ang maganda dito, ang pinagmamalaki ni Huawei dito eh, kasi is, uh, may, dalo, may dual SIM siya, okay? Dual SIM. Pero may isa pa, hindi siya hybrid. Okay. Hindi siya hybrid. Pero you, you still have an extra slot to put in your micro SD card. So, your uh, Huawei is not sacrificing. A single, uh, yung ano, para mag single SIM card siya. Right. Hindi, hindi nila sacrifice Kung gusto mo maglagay ng isang SIM card lang, uh, uh, at isang memory card, okay lang. Gusto mo maglagay ng dalawang SIM card, okay lang din. Kasi makakapaglagay ka pa rin ng memory card, which is here. No? Yun ang ano, yun ang pinagmamalaki ng Huawei. So, this is uh, this is what it looks like when it's turned on. And, uh, yeah, no, naglagay ako syempre ng passcode. Pero, I don't need a passcode because I have the uh, fingerprint scanner. So, I need yeah. to tap on the finger, fingerprint scanner and voila. Ayan na yung uh, ano. So, so, maganda yung placement actually. Sa so, mga nagtatanong, bakit ba lagi sa likod? Actually, maganda yung placement ng fingerprint sensor sa likod. Kasi pag nandun siya sa likod, uh, mas madali siya na-access ng index finger, which is laging nasa likod ng smartphone nyo pag hawak-hawak niya yung smartphone nyo. Right. And, uh, ano, um, the fingerprint, uh, the, the, the button sa likod, it's not only for, you know, for fingerprint scanner. You can also use it for selfies. Ah, okay. So, pwede rin. For taking okay. pictures. Oo. Oh, pwede rin. You can actually configure that. Now, uh, as as we all know, so Huawei, mm-hmm. yung ano nila, yung uh, motion UI ba tawag doon? Uh, yeah, EMUI. Or EMU, e, e, EMUI. So, uh, lahat ng apps na dito sa, ano, sa, sa harap, and um, yung dito sa motion UI, medyo ano eh, if you're, if matagal ka na gumagamit ng Huawei or nakikita ka parati ng Huawei na devices, you would always notice na parati itong magkakadugtong eh. Yung, 
MP3 player, yung ano, yung uh, wallpaper, and yung ano, yung weather, no? This is the same thing that we see with the Mate 8 and the, ano, yung nireview natin dati, yung, uh, G8, yung G8, yung uh, one of my Huawei favorites, no? Tapos, uh, pero you don't see anything, uh, you know, you don't see anything special on this, ano, on the home screen. However, when you go to the notification window, ito yung ano, ito yung pinaka pinaka gusto ko sa lahat sa sa uh motion emotion UI. No? Time naka ano, timeline yung notifications. It's according to the timeline. This okay. is uh, which is still the same with the with the, the previous na, na uh, sa G5, uh, sa G8, G8. Oh, pareho lang eh. Pero no, sa Mate 8 din alam ko ganyan. Oh, sa Mate 8 ganoon pa rin. Oh, pero 'yun ang gusto ko lang sa ano, I just like to say na ito yung gusto ko sa Emotion UI na um the you know the notifications that you get are according to the ano, according to um, to its timeline. Makikita mo ko ano oras na nakaroon ka ng uh, bagong email sa Gmail or sa Instagram, ano oras ka nagkaroon ng uh, at ano oras ka inad sa isang sa isang Instagram na ano account so ano eh ang gan uh, ganito yung gusto kong setup actually so and, uh, anything other than that um anything other than that uh nothing as special sa emotion UI pero it's ano it's user friendly okay uh, it's, it's definitely definitely user friendly uh you know for those people na for those users na sanay na sa iPhone yeah. or even yung mga matatanda na ayo na mga app drawer no? yeah yeah so uh, ang actually isa rin sa dahilan kung bakit walang app drawer ang uh, yung uh, Huawei is because yung Chinese market the Chinese market talaga even Vivo uh, Oppo we know those smartphones are uh, Uh, those are, uh, yeah, Joni, those smartphones came from China, those brands. Yeah. And uh, all of them doesn't have an app drawer kasi yung Chinese market talaga, mas prefer nila ang walang app drawer. Even Xiaomi. Look at Xiaomi. Wala rin Xiaomi, sila. Xiaomi. Oh, hal- actually, wala akong alam na, ewan ko kung may Chinese brand na gumagamit pa ng uh, yeah, yeah. app drawer. Parang lahat sila hindi na gumagamit. Ex- oh, of course, except the Nexus 6P because it's a Nexus. Yeah. So, yeah. Um, Okay, so let's talk about the performance of the phone. What did I say? No, I took uh, Antutu score. The Antutu score is uh, 37,092. So, oh. you know, today's standards na parati tayo nga Antutu, 37,000, medyo mababa na ito. Eh. Stop driving si Kikila. Oh, yeah. Uh, the, the processor of this one... Or 450, 410. Actually, hindi ko tanda Actually, hindi ko rin tanda eh. Pero, good question. Because, uh, alam ko, naka, ano to, naka Qualcomm na, na Snapdragon to. And we're going to check right now. Because I'm too busy uh, using the phone. And uh, nakakalimut ako na yung mga specs. Info. Let's go to info. Yeah, okay. Yeah, it's a Snapdragon ano lang siya. It is. Yeah. Okay, Or, ayun, 6.15. Uh, I'm sorry, 6.15, 8.4 siya. So, it's not plan on 6.15. Yeah, 6.15. Oh. So, uh, tama na lang. Tamang processor lang. Well, for a mid-range, or marami pa rin ako ganyan. Yeah. Now, um, like what I've said, no, uh, 37,000 is okay na lang. No? Okay lang. Nothing too special. And, we, you know, we've reviewed a lot of 6.1, uh, yes. 6.1.5 processors. They're good. Okay? They're good for, ano, pero mabilis ba? Mabilis ba sa ano? Mabilis ba yung ano sa Huawei GR5? Well, um at uh, according to my usage, no? although personally okay ako sa Huawei GR5, kundi lang kundi ako time arts, okay lang eh. But um, there are some time, there are times na ano, I notice na nagkakaroon ng lags. Uh-huh. As in naglalag. Na na, 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 na na when when you ano, when you say Say you're when you are going to move to one, you know, one pane, uh, one window pane, we can, you know, mag uh, stutter ng konte. Uh-huh. Or when you open an app, mag stutter ng konte. It happens once in a while. Uh-huh. No, it happens once in a while. Why? It's because, uh, well, uh, it only has two gigs of RAM, and uh, the sign na tayo na may three gigs of RAM, four gigs of RAM, 
and two gigs in uh well with the with with the apps that we use today medyo nagaano na rin uh palaki ng palaki yeah. mga apps the yeah. crowd na rin sa two gigs of rap kulang na kulang it's, na yeah nagiging na apektuhan it's still not bad okay it's yeah. still not it's still not bad i'm not saying it's really bad but uh it's some may you know will me forgive it pero um, sa mga people sa mga tao mga advanced users na gumagamit ng mga 4 gigs of ram and you know um they they they, they might find this phone uh, slow for their taste pero ano, it's, it's still not bad for an average user na bibili na, you know, so for example an entry level user or bibili nito maganda na yan super ganda na yan or for an intermediate user na mag upgrade pa lang to an 11,000 peso uh, smartphone. smartphone. Maganda, this, maganda. Pwede na, pwede na rin to. Uh, the, for, the 615 is ano, not bad naman. Uh, for basic task, even games. You can for, run games. For basic task. Oh, pero you know, if you, if what, if, like in my case, no, if, you, if you've been using this for quite a while, no, uh, na hindi ka nagre-reboot, Talaga ba nararamdaman mo na, ah, shit, mga bagal na. Yung lalo na, na like the other day, na nagpumultitask to the max ako. And uh, it's really slow because, ano na, ilang days na ako hindi nagre-reboot. Yeah. No? So, uh, we have to reboot it once in a while no? to, free up the, uh, to free up the space. Uh, okay, so, pero ano, it's fine. Okay, it's fine. I mean, I already, we already mentioned now how you can avoid it. Or, yun nga. But if you're sanay na sanay ka na sa 3 gigs of RAM, 4 gigs of RAM, no problem. 615, yung binabasura yung 615 processor, then, you know, don't listen to this, uh, <laughs> to this review anymore. Okay? So, ano, in games. Okay. Uh, games, uh, well, I try Nova 3 here. Why Nova 3? Because, um, I want to see you know, how it fares with this 615 compared sa, you know, uh, ang nakatatak pa rin sa memory ko yung 616 na ginamit ah, natin sa Zenfone Zen Laser 6 na nakakaroon ng lag. Unfortunately, ah. I don't know, I don't understand why. Pero, sabi ko, there must be something wrong with the 616. Pero, let's try with the 615. So, I'm gonna, I'm gonna play this game, ah. I'm gonna play this game. And, I've been playing this uh, 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 for this test. Every day ako naglalaro nito. Almost every day. Just to see kung magbabagal na siya. Uh-huh. And I'm in this phone. I've been using this phone for almost two weeks already. Okay. Okay. Uh, not that. Let's just wait. Uh, for sure, may mga dialogues na de Okay. But the gameplay is still good. Okay. The gameplay is still good. Bihira ako mag-lags. Hindi oh, okay. katulad sa, ano, sa, six, sa 616 uh, processor ng, ano, ng Laser 6.0, ng Zenfone, nag-ano eh. It's irritatingly, ano, uh, nakikita mo yung lag. It's really irritating. And Saan, I, don't, hindi. I don't understand it. Pero dito, hindi. The process is a bit. Tignan mo rin. Oh, no, no, no. Well, ngayon lag siya. Ngayon okay, may lag. Try mo nga i-exit lang yung ibang applications na naka-on. Kasi may possibility na... Ang dami nga na eh. Ang dami bukas na. So, it's... so I'm gonna exit Chrome, Settings. And Notifications. And Tutu, Gallery, Cherry Fit. And then I'm going to erase all the notifications. Oops. Okay, yes. Okay, Burado na. Now, let's play Nova 3 again. The shoe. Okay, so. Bumilis siya. Bumilis siya kahit pa paano. Oh wow. Mas okay yung graphics siya. Oh, okay. Okay. Dalag na konti. Pero... Nagalag. Maganda yung graphics na dyan na-expect. Ito lang bakit. Sa 4615. Yeah, mukhang ano eh. 
so yun yeah, because you have two gigs of RAM, again you have to clean all of your trash, so notifications and sa open open apps, uh, in order for this to run properly. So as long as you do that, the game is fine. Okay. It is a heavy graphics game, Jam. Oh, we, 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 we all know. know that, we all know this. We got to know about three. Number three. Yeah. So there's no lag. There's no lag anymore, right? So you know what I'm saying, Iko. Na okay, naman. Oh, okay, naman. It's, it's playable. It's playable. Very, yeah, very, very, you know, very playable, naman. All right. So that's the, that's the gaming part. Now, what about you know? What about the camera? Camera is different. Okay. Camera wise, there you go. The camera, camera is, you know, uh, I still find the G8 better than this. Okay. You know, mas sabi ko. Talaga uh, mas. G8 talaga. Oh, mas okay pa rin G8. Uh, I still swear by it. Ito kasi parang it maganda. Okay. Pero hindi kasi ganda na G8. Ah, okay. And G8, uh, 615 din yun, ha? Ah. 615 din yun. Ito, 615 na mas mura. Eh, kasi yung 3 gigs of RAM yun, eh. Ito, 2 gigs of RAM. Pero the camera, iba yung camera ng G8, eh. Uh, I forgot, ilang megapixel nga ba yun? G8? Uh, yeah. 8 or 13, something like that. Something like that, right? Uh. This one, uh, the resolution of the, the camera is the highest is 13 no so 13 megapixels din to all right so i'm going to go to ano i'm going to go to gallery kailan natin binisit to dalmo ubusan na pala ako ng battery okay, these are some of my shots ayan so to kimchi makit uh, matingkad ba yung kulay yeah makit ma anong man yung kulay ng kimchi chat red red Kita-kita yung red niya. See? Diba? Uh, Kita-kita yung pagka-red niya. Okay. What about this sushi? sushi. O, parang pale. Pale ba talaga yung sushi o pale yung colors? Pero okay yung colors ng board eh. Okay. Okay yung... Baka yung sushi. Sushi yung pale. May mukha yung sushi nga uh, eh. Ito. Yung selfie ni Mr. Mark Macanas. Yung pinaglaroan uh, niya. Uh, his day won't be complete without a selfie. Okay. Nasalob tayo na siya ang relay. Kung makain tayo. Ah, yes, yes. Uh, okay lang. Okay lang. Food? Again. Yeah, okay lang. Uh, nothing here. Okay, outdoors. Okay. Looks okay. Yeah, okay. Outdoors, no no doubt. Outdoor shots, no doubt. Okay, uh, ano. Let's zoom in. Tama naman yung colors niya. Okay, so there's no doubt outdoor, ano. Other photos taken by the GR5 are good. Ni, no, I don't see anything washed out here. Walang ano, hindi naman siya washed out. So, yeah, oh, uh, okay, okay naman. Average, average. Ito. Another food shot. Close up ng wings. And, uh, yung wings niya. They're not bad eh. Actually, maganda naman. Maganda. Crispy yung ano. Yung crispy chicken. Oh, hindi, oh, crispy din yung chicken breast. Oh, hindi ano eh. Hindi, wala ka nakikita rito ng pixelized or ano eh. Okay yung ano, okay pagkakuha ng chicken eh. Yeah. Well, ito rin oh. See? Okay siya. Okay ito. Okay, this one. Hindi sobrang ganda. Hindi naman siya pangit, di ba? Indoor to ha? Yeah. Ito, the burger. Yung kinahin kong burger. The bacon. Stop, stop looking. Yeah. It's, it's 12 a.m. and uh, gutom na ako. Yeah. Can we stop uh, bacon, checking out? Bacon, sarap ng bacon. Oh. Oy, gutom ka din. <laughs> yung ano, yung candy bacon. Oh uh, my please God. Please stop, please stop uh, pero, pero showing us pictures. Pero de, uh, it's uh, okay yung camera. Seriously, yun. ganda naman niya eh. Okay naman yung camera. Yun. Pero please, oh my God, please stop those burgers. Stop. <laughs> Or ano, yung, yung, yung pizza na kinain. Okay, in, in in a nutshell, in a nutshell, okay yung ano niya, okay yung camera niya sa food, uh, sa food okay yung uh, sa daylight, uh, indoor shots, nung pagupit ako, not bad din, maganda, naman yung, maganda yung kulay, accurate yung kulay niya, 
Now, if taken, ano, taken night outside, uh, uh, medyo talo-talo tayo dito. <laughs> Hindi maganda. Hindi masyado maganda. Um, let's see. This one, this one. Um, no, this one's not good. Challenging. Challenging. Challenging, you know. This one's challenging for uh, for night shots. Uh, so, yeah. Hindi siya, ano. Yung night shots lang yung medyo alanganin. Uh, there are shots na, uh, ito medyo mukhang patay ito eh. Tama ba ako dyan? Well, oo. Oh, medyo ano yung... Ito, mo, ano, hindi matingka din ito eh. Kuha, yeah. Hindi ko kayo pagkakuhin ng mga gold. Right. So, yun ang ano, yun ang mga... Pero ano, overall, pwede na. Pwede, pwede na itong, ano, itong GR5. So, so, when I say pwede, pwede na, pwede, pwede na yung camera, pwede, pwede na yung, ano, uh, it's not perfect. Uh, pero for its price, okay siya. Okay na okay. Uh, okay na okay. Kasi, kasi siguro may, may bias pa rin ako sa G8 mm-hmm. na, shit, ang ganda talaga ng G8. Tapos ang pinaglaruan pa. May, ikaw, may Nexus 6P ka, nanggaling ako sa Nexus 6P, uh, 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 na nireview natin. So, di ba, parang yung expectations natin na tumaas na, no? And then, boom! Dito tayo bumaba. Pero, whenever we think about the market, ng target market ito, okay na eh. Okay na. So, despite of the things that we said about the camera, or the, ano, or the RAM, na 2 gigs lang, pero, when you talk about the, ano, the premium body of, uh, of Huawei, when you talk about the ano naman yung, uh, yung software niya yung kahit na sabi mo 2 gigs of ram eh as as long as you know how to manage the memory you're going to live with it and uh, this can be your main phone the, the fact that this this continuously uh, uh, became my main phone for almost 2 weeks na parang Papalitan ko na ba ito? Magre-review na ba ang iba? Hindi, okay na yan. Guys, ano naman ako eh. Uh, parang nagamay ko na eh. And I don't mind using it. I don't mind. Na parang siguro, if this will be my service phone, uh, na in-assign sa akin isang kumpanya, okay na. Okay. Yan. Pwede na. Yeah. Oh, it's a, it's a, it's a, ne, parang average smartphone for average users na hindi heavy. Oh. Uh, Nag-games, pero oh. nag-Facebook. It's a really good smartphone for its price. 11,900 ba? Yeah, well, yeah, 11, or 10,900? 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, ng, uh, ng hardware and networks din ha? networks uh, din you get, you get a Huawei GR5 yeah, yeah. it's a really nice, nice smartphone yeah yeah uh, good uh, uh, I, 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 there's no perfect score I, I wouldn't really highly recommend it but definitely recommendable yeah alright Jam any, you know, any last words? well wala na well bukod sa sinabi ko kanina it's an average smartphone for average users not uh, hindi bagay sa mga hardcore users uh, yeah. pero more than enough sa mga consumers na pa Facebook Facebook lang mga ganun feature yep all right so that's our hands on review segment for tonight and uh, we'll see you in the next hands on review segment maybe tomorrow uh, hopefully we still have energy <laughs> so uh Sige na, matutulog na kami. <laughs> That's all for, uh, for, tonight, uh, for, uh, for tonight. Good night.